So this is a video tutorial on how to install the Unreal Bot. I know a lot of people have trouble with this. So once you get on the website, if you come down, now that you're a paid member, and you go to private access, depending on what bot you're going to install, but really it doesn't matter because they're all on the same bot. <coughs> um, you can click on how to use blacklight retribution cheat um, here it's going to give you the download link on how to download the bot this is the actual link you're going to click on this this is going to actually download it if you look at the bottom of my screen it's going to download it to my computer and later I'll show you how to save that to your desktop now once you have finished doing everything I'm gonna tell you in this video for most games you're gonna push the home key to pull up the menu um, and we'll get to that later in another video but now um, usually they have a fax in there but they don't have one so we're going to change this I'm going to get you guys, okay. So actually, you can get the bot, I'm going to redo this video anyways, but you can get the bot from Unreal Bot forward slash forum forward slash T5001. Same thing, you go to the top, download the stream cheat. It's either going to be home or F4 depending on the game, but most of the games, like I said, are home. <clears throat> These are all of the options and if they're red they're not on if they're green they're on you'll see that in the menu but if you come down you have to download everything on this list for this to work okay if you're 64 bit uh, if you're 64 bit then you need to download everything on here if you're a 32 bit then you just download the 32 bit stuff and you can read it tells you 32 bit tells you 64 bit then after you download every one of these and install them to your computer which I'll show you in other videos then you restart your computer after you restart your computer you open the stream client you log in you go to the game you want to cheat on and you click stream then after it streams it'll say searching for that game once it's searching for that game, you start AVA, or the game that you want to play. And again, I'm going to make more videos on this. <coughs> if for some reason you've tried this and it's not working, you can go through and delete your game guard folder, which is located in your IJJI folder in your C drive. You click on English, click on AVA if that's the game, binaries, and then game guard, and delete everything inside of it. Steam is the same thing. And then uh, you can start the loader. And there you go. Um, if you have any problems, you can jump on WebIRC for more, more information.